You're joining a satanic cult and killing and gathering the blood of virgins while doing some freaky ass naked dancing shit to the PhD man child. So Ran no Wo To also known as Sound of the Sky, a military moe adventure wartime 14 episode story. This show is a bit more obscure, um, flopped at the time of release, did not become very popular. Saw a few episodes for a friend and never heard of it again. Been hunting this out for a very long time. So this is a World War II era style setting, or pretty much there was a future with high-tech warfare and whatnot, which almost destroyed and left the world in ruin, losing technology, and the world is rebuilding up to scratch to a World War II, pre-World War II standard, you know, cobblestone building, and there's remnants left over of the ruin of modern cities and um, the old weapons left behind. So there's these um, ethnic tensions between these two great nations, which we don't see a lot of because we're mostly focusing on this outreach uh, town, uh, a unit of uh, five women. And around this town there's an ancient uh, legend regarding five maidens that five stops a fire beast. So these five girls, uh, one of them is a new recruit and she joins the army uh, to learn a musical instrument, uh, the trumpet which is uh, very unusual for the military. It's normally a bugle. You find out why later. Uh, fascinating story. So she joins up and she's a very klutzy, clumsy uh, girl. Actually, a lot of these girls resemble either Kaon characters or bloody other um, mainstream types. But uh, it's done quite well. So she joins this unit and uh, the stories are not exactly uh, consistency, consistent, there's uh, different things happening in each episode and she grows a bond with these uh, girls in her units and they go out and do interesting things and she interacts with their uh, different abilities. And what started off as being a terrible trumpet player, she nurtures. Now the eve of war breaks out and the two sides are out to meet each other. I'm not going to go too much into uh, the storyline or spoilers, but it's quite a wonderful and uh, a beautiful story. Uh, the machinery is almost borderline steampunk. Uh, there are strong protest messages um, that's very anti-war uh, about how devastating the past uh, conflicts were. 10 out of 10, well drawn. Music scores great, music's great. Check it out.